Hello, Stuart Heath, CEO and founder of Harvard Grace Capital, with just a quick uh, note about uh, unemployment and where we are in, this, uh, in the uh, economy right now. Uh, it, it always strikes me that our national financial media uh, likes to state things with simplicity and absoluteness. Uh, however, the um, when you drill down, and, and we, all, we all wonder what the Fed's going to do, and the prob problem is they have to uh, move interest rates um, you know, once for all. But the economy is made up of really at least 50 different economies and sometimes more. And I like to look at this uh, periodically uh, as the unemployment rate by state. Uh, and where I pulled up here is the Bureau of Labor Statistics through April. I don't have the, the monthly numbers for um, uh, May just yet. Uh, and, and then they rank those from low unemployment to high unemployment. And you know, it, it's fascinating to see. You know, some of the um, best economies in the world, if you would, uh, are, are right here in the United States. And uh, you know, with the lowest unemployment, North and South Dakota, with their oil business uh, going, uh, you know, gangbusters up there. Uh, Vermont, uh, I'm not sure what's driving that economy, but uh, they're the number, uh, uh, number, they're the third lowest. And then you get into uh, places like uh, Maryland and New Hampshire and Minnesota and Iowa, Kansas, and then you get into a whole swath of southern states with Mississippi, uh, Virginia, Alabama, Georgia, um, uh, yeah, Tennessee, South Carolina, uh, not, not to dismiss Wyoming or, or Massachusetts, but look, look at those tight, uh, very low, very healthy um, unemployment rates. Then you scroll down to the other end, uh, you, you, some some but no shock there with California, D.C., uh, and, and let's just say a lot of uh, bluer states. Uh, and, and frankly, a lot of these are the states that um, held on to the COVID policies the longest, and their economies are still suffering even today. So that's why uh, with us, the number one rule in investing is location, location, location. What state is it in? And even, of course, we'll drill down what's, what suburb or what county is it in? Uh, uh, what suburb of what city is it in? Because uh, location matters. Uh, you might have a, a superb opportunity in California. So it's not the best uh, economy in the uh, states right now. But there might be a, a exceptionally good uh, local uh, opportunity there. Likewise, uh, in North Dakota, you, there might be a, an opportunity that's bad, even though that state is generally doing pretty well. So just be mindful when you're hearing the news media talk about office is dead or, or all commercial real estate is dead. It's just not true. It's all heavily uh, impacted by locality. Uh, and this is one of the ways that you can go about um, uh, figuring out uh, what's, uh, what, what's best. Even and you can even drill down from state level to county levels. Uh, you know when, when they get around to getting those statistics out, it's fascinating stuff if you've uh, if you've got the time for it. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Thanks.